Everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Gaming. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to play mouse and keyboard on your PlayStation 5 game. So this could be relatively easy. Some of the games just uh, support this, so you don't really have to do anything. Um, like New World, uh, Final Fantasy, and then Elder Scrolls Online. If you're playing MMORPGs, uh, I believe it only works with just the keyboard, so you can uh, type. So some games have full support, and some games have like partial support. New World is a game that has full support where I can use the keyboard to move and then I can just press enter and then I can type in my message right here and then it's easy just to quickly chat so definitely great for MMORPGs otherwise playing Call of Duty uh, you can play that you just have to go into the settings options and switch it from controller over to uh, mouse and keyboard for it to work in the game so this is New World. Uh, this game supports uh, the controller and um, mouse and keyboard. So I can just go back and forth really quick. Now there's a couple different ways that you can connect these. This is a Bluetooth keyboard. Now with this one, I think the batteries are actually dead now. But there's going to be a specific way in which you connect it. You have to press the Bluetooth button and the FN key right here. So this one is the Z key and FN. And this will put it into the Bluetooth pairing mode and it'll allow me to connect to it. So we have to go to the home screen here and then go to settings, accessories, and it's a little bit more complicated using a Bluetooth one. Then go to Bluetooth accessories and you can see I have the Anchor A7726 uh, but go down to accessories found and once you put it into the Bluetooth pairing mode so you have the FN key and Z key. If you press both of these I think my batteries are dead, but it should put it into the Bluetooth pairing mode where this blue light blinks. And then a code is going to pop up on the screen. You just have to type in like the five digit code, like five, six, seven, eight, nine, something. And then press enter on your keyboard and it should connect. So you can connect Bluetooth keyboards. Uh, another keyboard that I have, uh, this one has a trackpad on it, just like this. And this one has a Bluetooth dongle. So I can just plug this one into the front of my PlayStation 5. And these ones are really easy to use because as soon as you connect them, you're good to go. So I don't know if the batteries work on this one either, but we can see. Uh, okay, it's connecting the top right. So I can go back on over to my game. And I might like this one more because I don't have to press the enter button to use it. So I'm still getting a little weird thing. I don't know why this game lags with uh, keyboards. I think it's just um, Bluetooth keyboards. And I got my trackpad works here too. So if I want to go ahead and use that. So you can just pick up a USB mouse and keyboard and it should work right away. Does anything else work here? So I don't know if I want to have this one connected when I'm playing. Otherwise this Bluetooth one down here. But just make sure you don't use uh, lose the little doggo on it if you're not going to be using it. So is this one connecting. This one's not working right now. Probably have to reconnect it. But Yep, very simple. Hopefully this video did indeed help you out. Did leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on your six gaming.